I want to review another free software for removing programs from your computer. In my previous video I reviewed Revo and Installer, but what I failed to mention was that the free version of Revo and Installer only removes 32-bit programs. So that's why if you ever used it and were wondering why some programs that you had that weren't listed in Revo and Installer is because the free version of Revo and Installer only lists 32-bit programs. So without further ado, I want, to, I want to introduce another free program that is just about the same as Revo Uninstaller, if not better, and it's called IOBit Uninstaller. And that, re that lists 32-bit uh, programs and 64-bit programs. Now, it's a free program, and I'm going to show you where to download it from and how to install and use it. So the first step is to open up your web browser. I'm going to be doing this in um, Opera Web Browser. So you want to type in at the top, iobit uninstaller. And once you type that in, you're going to get a bunch of links and you're going to click on the first link, the .iobit.com English Advanced Installer PHP. Once it takes you to that, to the site, you're going to click on free download. And at the top here, where it says iobit uninstaller, it tells you the version you're going to click on download now. It should take five seconds until it starts. Because I installed it, uh, I downloaded it already. Um, okay, I'll just do it again. Why not? It should be installed in the download folder. So, as you can see, I have both of them because I installed it previously. But you're going to click on you're going to click on the iobit installer. And this is important you're going to want to want to uncheck install advanced system care to optimize your PC. I'm not I won't cover that in this video. And you're going to click run now. And here we see that it shows you all of the programs that you have installed on your computer. Now, if you didn't watch my previous video, I want to mention that uh, if you didn't watch my previous video, I want to I want to tell you guys that Windows uninstaller does not uninstall everything that uh, that the app has. So basically what I'm trying to say is when you're trying to install uh, some apps, some programs from your computer, some of these programs leave back, uh, leave, they leave some certain files on your computer that they just stay there in the registry and you know who knows where. And it kind of, I mean, if you're using older hard drives, if you're not using an SSD, it will bog down your hard drive with all this unnecessary crap. So that's why that's where these third-party programs like Revo Uninstaller, IOBit Uninstaller, uh, come in. So let's say, for example, I want to remove hmm, about this app. I haven't used this app in a while. Let's do a powerful scan. You see, as you can see it's leaving traces over from that program. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on that and remove remove the traces over. And I'm going to click on delete. Let's find another program to delete. And I'm going to delete unlockers since I never used it. And it would be a good idea to put a check mark by the set of restore point. But for the sake of this video I'm not going to just because it's a lot faster if I don't. As you can see, it found all these files, and I'm going to click on the delete button to remove them from my system because this is the leftover files. So once I uh, once I remove it, that's pretty much done, and that is IOBit software. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time.